Well, still good morning, YouTube fans. It is uh, Friday, June 16th, 2023. Time is just a couple of minutes before noon. Uh, we are on Lake Hennessy, which is located on the hills on the east side of the Napa Valley. Uh, pretty much east of uh, St. Helena, the town of St. Helena. And we have uh, been rowing this morning for uh, not quite two and a half hours. And uh, I just put a new battery into the uh, 360 camera and uh, decided I would uh, use an old mount that I made actually to go on the uh, port quarter of the boat and I thought I would mount it off the bow which I've tried before <clears throat> and uh, just uh, so you get another point of view. This way, you'll be able to see where we're going uh, without having to look at me. And uh, so when I edit it, it will be uh, an interesting experience since I always had the camera off, the, almost always had the camera off the stern. <clears throat> the uh, weather forecast today was for uh, mostly clear, mostly sunny, uh, high of 84. Uh, the winds were to be out of the, uh, I think it was the west, uh, southwest at uh, between 5 and 11 miles an hour and so far the winds have been out of the south uh, almost south southeast and uh, the highest uh, we recorded was uh, a little less than I think 9 miles an hour a little while back so not really gusty at all. Quite a nice smooth ride. The water's pretty flat. And right now we are headed uh, along the uh, northeasterly shore. Uh, actually, northwesterly shore. <clears throat> the northwesterly shore of uh, Lake Hennessy. Um, and staying offshore a bit because uh, this side of the lake has some shoal areas and there's lots of uh, uh, different kinds of plant life growing up and laying on the surface and I was getting harvesting that with my rudder so we're staying out here where the water's a little deeper And uh, the uh, lake doesn't have all that many boats on it. Uh, there were probably maybe eight, eight boat trailers or so in the uh, parking lot when I got here this morning. And uh, they're all fishermen. Uh, some uh, outboards and uh, Quite a few kayaks, really elegant fishing kayaks, uh, purposely designed for fishing, so they're uh, quite a bit broader and more stable. Saw one fellow standing up and casting in a kayak, which is uh, he's got better balance than I do. <clears throat> uh, talking to a few of the fishermen, they aren't catching a lot of fish, but uh, it's a gorgeous day to be out here, so everybody's having fun. 
The course we had planned for today and have been uh, carrying out so far is uh, to launch, uh, which is over on the uh, southerly side of the lake up toward the east end uh, along Highway 128. And uh, we've been doing a uh, clockwise turn around the lake. So far gone uh, almost 4.8 miles. Um, I went on uh, Google Earth last night and did a uh, uh, path trace around the uh, perimeter of the lake and uh, it was about seven and a half miles total. <clears throat> So I expect it will be, maybe we'll do about seven and a little bit today because right now we're rowing across the mouth of a, a wide bay. Going here uh, pretty much point to point. Uh, off in that direction uh, on the skyline there I believe are the uh, the ridge of hills on the west side of Napa Valley so uh, the other side of that would be the uh, Sonoma Valley was a, uh, a white pelican swimming out on our starboard side out toward the middle of the lake. It looked like he was uh, coming up this way, but I don't see him anymore. Publish this this video on uh, the Ragtime Billy Peaches YouTube channel. I appreciate it if you'd uh, if you're not subscribed already. If you click on the subscribe button and uh, give us a like, thumbs up. Those two uh, functions are a big deal with YouTube. Uh, oh, there he is. He's over there at the shore, hanging out with some uh, Canada geese. I'm going to row over that way, just kind of taking it easy and...
scare them, but uh, I'd like to get up close. Got the wind behind us, so uh, it'll help us in the right direction. geese and the pelican are all keeping a little hairy eyeball out for us. And the pelican's getting nervous, so I'm going to slow down here. I don't want it to fly away. drifting down on him, so I'm going to turn around and pull away here. <clears throat> Handsome birds. Just gorgeous. Turn around and give you a view off the uh, starboard side of the boat. They're really large birds. It looks like he's masses about four Canada geese. And Canada geese is a pretty big bird.
very, very slowly drifting in toward them. Buffalo wind is speeding us up here. He's, I don't want him to get nervous and fly away, so I'm going to push off a bit here.
wind's increasing a little bit and it's uh, getting a little bit more problematic to uh, keep the boat right where I want it without splashing the oars about, disturbing the wildlife. So we're going to uh, pull out here and resume our course. See you later, Billy Can. <clears throat> the Ogden Nash, who used to write interesting doggerel. An amazing bird, the pelican. His beak can hold more than his belican. Sixty camera in the bow now can you see him. So we are once again headed uh, southeast along the northeasterly shore of this portion of Lake Hennessy. Winds up just a bit. There's four miles an hour. So that's very nice. All right, well, it's been about the right amount of time here. For the uh, 360 camera to turn itself off. So, before it does that, I'd like to thank you all for coming along, enjoying this gorgeous day out here on the water, and uh, being able to watch that beautiful pelican. camera off a bit here for a while until we get around the corner and uh, we'll catch you all later. Stop recording. <laughs>